morning everyone today is monday march 25th and today's a weigh-in there's a ladybug anyway if you guys see me looking away from the camera a lot today there's a ladybug on my window and i want to make sure it doesn't just randomly disappear on me i don't like bugs any kind i don't care if it's a ladybug nothing I don't like them. <laughs> so I'm sorry. I don't mean to be distracted, but I'm horrified. So today is a weigh-in. I weighed myself earlier today. It's it's kind of closer to noon right now. It's like 1130. So I did weigh myself earlier in the morning. I weighed at 260.0. So I'm, I'm the same as last week. I'm not too crazy about it. But again, I'll take staying the same over gaining. I just want to keep losing. So I'm a little discouraged type of thing. I didn't like I've been kind of going back and forth on being good I really didn't have any soda this week which was awesome I didn't even notice I didn't have soda but God, I'm thirsty too I really didn't have any soda but I wasn't having as much water as the previous week where I was having like 100 ounces a day I'm still having a lot more water than I have in the past just not as much as like I just did and I want to get back to that because I think that was the best thing for my body I also just I don't know I've been really tired lately I'm not exactly sure why I'm just really tired you know I've been eating a lot of like healthier snacks too like just the last two days specifically like I've had like raw string beans as a snack I used to eat that in college <laughs> um I stopped doing that but it's just something really good and refreshing for me um and I've been eating a lot of strawberries and like and a little bit of watermelon my mom had bought like a little mini one from the store we're not fully in season yet, so it wasn't perfect, but you know, watermelon is watermelon. So we had that. So I've definitely been incorporating more fruits and vegetables into my diet. Now I just need to kind of keep up with it, keep up with the water, continue doing well. I start physical therapy today, so get that activity in. I've been in a lot of pain, so I didn't do any exercising at home last week. It's just, I don't know. I don't know what I did to my foot, but like it hurts to, you know, when you step and you go forward, like right in the front, I'm hurting. My hips hurt, my back hurts. I'm just in pain, it's just been one of those weeks. My back hurts because of the, just the tightness in general, but, and my hips are partially because of my son. I don't know about the foot though. The foot is kind of throwing me off. But yeah, so, you know, maybe I just need to start eating a little earlier and start my day, maybe th that waiting is kind of confusing my body. But if, I oh, it's coming closer. But if I'm eating so much more food, because I am still eating a lot now compared to what I used to be, um, my husband still insists that it's not actually a lot because I'm just eating what a normal person should be eating at this point. Sure, I'll believe him. I mean, it makes sense. I am eating like, usually now I'll eat like three meals a day. So technically, yes, I am doing good. But there's still are days where I eat like one or two. So he's not 100% sold on the three meals but you know he is saying that I'm doing a lot better and uh I guess yeah I'm eating normally but um to me it's just so much more so even though I'm eating so much more food I'm not gaining weight that's really like reassuring to me so I just need to kind of make some changes tweak it maybe see what's going on and why I'm not going down but yeah so that's it on my weight loss as far as medical updates other than the trigger point injections that I did last week, I haven't seen any doctors, haven't like had anything to do with any of that. Today I start my first day of physical therapy. I have to go in at like five at night, so it's, it's a little bit of a late appointment, but okay. I'm a little confused now because like in the past with my old insurance, we didn't have to pay any copay. There was no deductible. There was nothing I had to worry about. So now I have a copay and a deductible, and I'm not exactly sure how that works with physical therapy. So we'll see how it goes. I have to do it. I don't want the trigger point injection to be a waste. Um, I'm already like as tight as can be. So I just, I just want some relief. Pain is just, it's just getting to be too much. Other than that, my son had an appointment. So I guess he had a doctor's appointment, but he's doing great. It was just a wellness visit. He's, he's my little, my little champ. The doctor, his doctor was very impressed by his progression and his development and he was shocked to hear about some of the things that my son does right now at his age so that was really exciting as for this week other than the physical therapy my mom has a follow-up appointment for her foot hopefully they can take her out of the air cast so that'll be exciting but that's it medically last week I didn't really do any vlogging like I didn't take any videos of anything I did because I was in so much pain I didn't really leave the house too much 
so I really didn't do anything last week except I did go to an outlet mall just to get some clothes for my son. He's getting too big. I can't keep up. It's going to be part of his Easter gift. So, you know, we were able to get a lot of things on sale. Plus, I had a lot of coupons. So, it really worked out. I felt really good about that. And I did end up getting a couple things for myself. Not much. I don't really shop for myself as a whole. But I figured I could have some cute stuff to wear when I go out and when I vlog and when I do my videos for you guys. It'll be really cute. I'm really excited. But yeah, that was that was basically it. I've been so, like I said, I've been in so much pain. I've been exhausted. It's just been a weird week. I don't really understand everything. This week, I'm hoping to decorate for Easter. I know that sounds crazy to a lot of people. Um, my Easter is not this Sunday. My Easter is on Cinco de Mayo this year. Um, I'm Greek Orthodox, so our Easter is very rarely on the same day as Catholic Easter. So... Um, this year, though, it's like super far apart. Usually it's not this big of a gap between the both Easters, but this year it is. So, you know, I wanted to decorate, at least have it for a Catholic Easter so my son can enjoy it. But like, it's going to be up a lot longer and it could be prepared for, for Greek Easter. My mom also wants to, there's this like Easter festival thing at a farm near us. So we are going to go to that and, you know, that'll be our week. Nothing too, too crazy. I've been for a while now thinking of different ways to like change some of the content on my channel and just kind of bring it to another level um, for my weight loss. I wanted to maybe sometimes include, you know, a what I eat in a day video or like maybe my measurements. I can measure myself. I'm just not sure how to go about everything and I'm a little overwhelmed because I'm thinking of every different aspect of my channel and I'm, I think I'm going to take the week to try to break down each aspect so break down my weight loss break down my vlogs break down my book review and then kind of change one at a time or see what I want to do differently so yeah hopefully I can do that um, I'm really excited I really enjoy doing this stuff so I just kind of need to slow slow my roll a little bit just so I don't get overwhelmed and like stressed about it because I don't want to mess it up either so that was that's it for my weight loss i don't really have much else to say i'm impressed with how i've been eating i'm impressed that i'm eating more like i'm like i'm happy that i'm eating more i'm happy that i'm getting the the nutrition in there that it's not like junk food it is vegetables and fruits and meats and it's a lot of stuff that can keep me keep me full or give me the, the energy i need the nutrients i need everything so i'm really happy about that i'm happy that soda hasn't really played a big role in my daily life uh for the last few weeks especially like the last week really has been amazing there have definitely been a few weeks i've told you guys about you know my soda intake and i'm genuinely those weeks have been some of the best weeks for me doing soda in a very long time so those just like one week here and there it just makes me so proud but like it's been more consistent lately and that's what makes me happy <laughs> so now it's just like a waiting game now it's just gonna be kind of treating my body to be healthier taking care of it, losing weight. It may not be as fast as before because I definitely changed some things up. And uh, now it's now it's kind of trying to reset its metabolism with all my health issues. So we'll see. I'm excited to see where it goes. So that is it for today. Um, if you like the video, please hit the like button. Comment if you have anything to say, any advice, any thoughts, anything. Subscribe if you haven't already and hit the notification bell to be informed every time I post a new video. I appreciate all the support so far and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!